the Dolly cargo ship has been removed from the Patapsco River, marking a milestone in the recovery effort after the collapse of the Key Bridge back in March. You are looking live. It's what is left at the site after crews tugged the Dolly out and refloated it and then brought it to a marine terminal yesterday. Well, despite the major step, Governor Westmore says there is still a long road ahead. I will not be satisfied until I can look over the same site and see the Francis Scott Key Bridge standing again. That's mission completion. Fox 45's Maxine Stryker joins us live with a closer look at what's next in this cleanup effort. Maxine. Well, Mary, it is a whole new view here along the Patapsco River tonight. Take a look. The Dolly cargo ship no longer on the horizon after eight weeks stuck with the bridge draped over it. Today, a 400 wide, 50 foot deep channel is now open for 24 7 operations. And by the end of the month, Governor Westmore says that channel will expand to 700 feet and fully reopen vessel traffic to the port. And while over 10,000 tons of steel has been lifted from the water, the mission is not complete as work continues to remove debris from the Patapsco. You can no longer see really any steel above the waterline uh, in the areas outside the federal channel. And they are going to continue to work on those sections of the spans that are just north of and south of the channel. And they estimate that they're going to be complete with that sometime in June. And Maxine, what about a timeline on rebuilding the bridge? Well, Mary, that's the final part of the mission, and the governor calling it an aggressive plan, but says they do hope to have the key bridge rebuilt by 2028. As for the cargo ship, the Dolly, it is in the port of Baltimore now, but we'll head to Norfolk in a few weeks for repairs. The crew members, the governor says, finally able to get off the ship tonight. Reporting live in Dundalk, Maxine Stryker, Fox 45 News. I'm Kai Jackson. Thank you for watching. Here's another video to watch. Also, please take a moment to subscribe to our channel.